So, I have a question from uh, uh, Sneha Lata Gangavani from uh, Mumbai and she writes, I am a physics teacher grade 11 Mumbai, can you please clarify a small doubt? The duration of day time is greater than duration of night time due to property of refraction or scattering and she writes, there was a big debate among physics teachers regarding the same. Some of us were in favor of refraction and others in favor of a scattering. Can you please clarify the, this explanation? So, it is good that uh, you people debate on physics issues and because uh, going beyond the textbook, putting mind that is how you develop yourself and uh, uh, physics is uh, enjoyed. Now, regarding this daytime and night time, these phenomena are not due to refraction or scattering by atmosphere. It is essentially a geographical phenomena. You have sun, you have earth, earth is going around the sun, then earth is rotating, the axis of rotation is at some 23 degrees from that the plane of uh, movement around sun called ecliptics and then on the globe where you are located, which month of the year you are in, these things will decide how much is the day time and how much is the night time and uh, we all know that they vary. They vary during uh, January you have something different, February you have something different. June you have something different and there are places and there are uh, times when night time is indeed greater than the day time. I am calling day time means what from sunrise to sunset that is the day time and the other part is night time. So, this is purely geographical phenomena rotation of earth and then uh, motion of earth around the sun that will decide what will be the daytime and what will be the night time. Now, refraction and scattering play a different kind of role. If you only consider this uh, rotation and motion and of earth, then uh, you can calculate how much should be the daytime from sunrise to sunset. But because of atmosphere, the sunrise actual when I see the sun that is a sunrise that is a slightly earlier than the actual sun coming to horizon. So, if I if I say that this is the earth and let us say this is equator and the axis of rotation is here. So, the earth is rotating let us say earth is rotating this way and I am somewhere here. So, this is the horizontal, this is the horizontal east and let us say sun is somewhere here, here sun, sun is here. So, it is below the horizon that means the sunrise has not yet taken place. If I am here and sun is here and if I join this uh, sun to my location, it will hit the earth somewhere here. So, this much of earth is in between and I should not be able to see this sunrise. But then because of atmosphere, because of this atmosphere which is there, when this, uh, this light travels like this and then it enters the atmosphere, it turns, it turns little bit. So, if, if light is going in this direction let us say and then it enters the atmosphere and turns and then reaches us. So, I can see the sun and you can say that daytime has increased because of refraction, but do not compare with night time. And this increase in daytime because of this atmospheric uh, refraction is few minutes, 2-3 minutes at the time of sunrise as well as uh, at the time of sunset. So, those few minutes the daytime is longer than what is expected from the rotation of earth and motion of earth that is because of refraction. And scattering also has a role that is uh, even if the sun is not visible, 
the, the sun is still below and suppose even after refraction it is not reaching me. But then the light which is going this way, light which is going this way, then the air molecules here, atmosphere here can scatter here and there and the light can reach, not, not, I, can, not I cannot see the sun but the light is reaching because of this uh, scattering that is why the uh, light start coming much before uh, the sunrise and light stays there uh, uh, even after the, the sunset. So, if you call that as daytime then again this daytime is increased because of a scattering even after the sunset we have some light even, uh, even before the sunrise, sunrise means even after, even before that uh, atmospheric refraction could have shown me the sun, even before that early in the morning, very early in the morning you do have light. So, if you call the, if we include those things also in daytime, then yes because of scattering daytime becomes longer, but longer than what? Not longer than night time, longer than what you expect from the rotation of the earth and movement of the earth. <coughs>